Men are like ladders. So we use them. Licensed CEO has set the internet on fire after she said this about men and how women should use them. Off. What would a man be doing with his life if not making a woman happy, giving her money? The controversial relationship experts left the entire Nigerian men in awe after revealing how women should treat them and what they should never do to men, no matter how strong the love or relationship and how much good the man is to them. Guys, I want you to follow me to the end of this video to see the full gist and analyze together with me. Of a truth, many Nigerians believe that the controversial relationship expert always makes sense sometimes when she speaks. But this time around a lot of her fans are really confused about the kind of life-ending advice she gave to them in an interview on a live television program when she was asked a sensitive question and her response has left many in shock but before i play you the video to see i want you to tell me in the comment section if what blessing ceo said in the interview makes any sense or it's a nonsense and as a lady is it a kind of advice you can run with and live with leave your opinion in the comment section and don't forget to share this video for others to comment as I leave you to watch the video bye bye now do you think women attach too much emphasis to and focus more on what they think they can get out of men mm, I don't think so because we are built that way even in the Bible when God created um, Eve everything was already beautiful we came into a very beautiful garden just to enjoy so I don't think so women are built out of beautiful stuff what would a man be doing with his life if not making a woman happy giving her money that's what they are created no, you say giving her money can't a woman herself earn her own money men are like ladders so we use them to climb <laughs> <laughs> Yes, that's what it is. You use them to climb. We use them to climb. Yeah, I used to tell um, women that a man's money is your plan A, your money is your plan B. That plan B is when the man decides to start to mess up, you fall back to what you have, what you've gotten from him, what you've planted. You get the seed from him, you plant it, it germinates. How many women plant seeds? That's the problem. Because that's an issue. Not every woman has the IQ to plant. You can't force them. I used to say in Igbo language, we have oliako, we have odoziako. It simply means there are women that are coming to chop money and there are women that are coming to also invest money depending on the one you want. Yeah, but this chop money matter, like we were saying. Mm -hmm. The truth of the matter is, I've heard of instances where in our day, would you encourage young girls who are with partners who really don't have much to support their partners financially? you can support if you have but i think it's a very big risk i would say anything you want to give a man give it to yourself yeah but it's to help the man grow maybe grow yourself let the man grow himself 